Howdy folks, this is Checkers, and this is Kingdom Come Deliverance. First, before we get into our, well, let's play, let's take a look at the options that we have available to us here. So we have Continue, New Game, Load Game, Settings, Help, Credits, and Quit. Let's take a look at the all-important settings. Game settings, we can select Language, English, French, German, Text Language, English, French, Spanish, German, Italian, Russian, Chinese, Polish, Czech, and back to English. Dialogue and cutscene subtitles, yes or no. In-game chatter subtitles, yes or no. And we can go back, we'll save those changes. Graphics settings, we will be playing at 1920 by 1080. And I think we're going to go full screen. But we have window, borderless, and full screen. Overall image quality is high at the moment. We could do very high, ultra high, or custom. What can we find under custom, I wonder? Show FPS off or on. Vertical field of vision. 65 degrees, 70, 75. We'll leave it at that 65 there. Save changes. Now, let's see what we get with our custom. Advanced graphic settings. Object quality high, game effects high, lighting high, particles high, physics high. And let's see, we have very high, ultra high, low, medium, and high. For the object quality, game effects, lighting, particles, physics, post-process quality, shader quality, shadows, textures, water details, volumetric effects detail, vegetation detail, object distance, uh, LOD distance, vegetation draw distance, and motion blur. And let's go back and have a chat. With the music volume. Okay, so we've got our Indian music volume, our sound volume, and voice and cutscene volume. We'll actually turn that up a bit. And controls. I am very fascinated in this one. General left. I want to be able to map to the numeric keypad. Okay. Actually. And then right, numeric 3, good. Forward, numeric 8. Back, numeric 2, accept or use. Numpad, enter. Skip dialog. Space, mouse, right, that's fine. Abort, escape, or backspace, fine. Jump. I want to use numpad plus, sprint. I want to use the left key, toggle crouch. I want to use the down key, toggle run. Um, hmm. I'm going to leave that one loose for right now. Well. Yeah, I suppose we can leave that at caps lock. Rotate left. Numpad 4, rotate right, numpad 6. Primary attacks are good. Abort attack, that's interesting. Let's put that as numpad period. Lock on opponent. Numpad 7, special attack. Numpad 0, block right. Draw melee weapon. Hmm. Let's go with zero and plus next opponent. That's interesting. Wheel up and wheel down. Sure, I'll give that a whirl. Unlock target. We'll put that on numpad nine. Surrender. I beg your pardon. Oh, well, if it's that important, we'll try page up for hands up, right? Inventory, numpad minus, player tab, page down, horse. Um, is H doing something important? 
If not, we'll make that each. Open quest log, journal, I can do that. Map, I can handle that, but we'll also add it to home. Let's put our quest log on end. And I think the rest of it, I'll bet anything we can cycle through this. Toggle info, curious about this one, but until we figure out what it is, we'll leave it be. Take screenshot, secondary minigame action. Hmm, tertiary minigame action. Reset alchemy bench. Increase sharpening pressure, decrease sharpening pressure. So, lots of controls. Can't wait to try them all out. Confirm, we'll save changes. And yeah, I'm actually going to hop out and take a look at the NVIDIA GeForce experience and let it choose the optimal settings for my setup. And then we'll be back to try out Kingdom Come Deliverance. So for the moment, I would like to say thank you for watching. I hope you found the video informative and maybe just a little entertaining. I would like to invite you to subscribe, like, and a share if you so desire. And to ask you, above all, to please take care.